Greetings, my brave fighter friends, Ben Pearson, the Roadster Tracker, and we're slowly, slowly working on our um, robot distribution, which we are most, most excited to see. But for now, I think I want to work on the volcanic ash, and we're going to build this with the idea that uh, we're going to have robots doing it later, because it's kind of a crazy system. So let's see. Extractor, it's refractory brick, relief valve, wells, and steel sheets. Okay. So wells, we're definitely going to be importing from our other well generation site. We don't need a ton of wells, so that makes perfect, perfect sense. Eh, 292, that's not bad. Um... I'm just looking to see if there's still sheets anywhere near here. The refractory brick, we're not going to have that close to here. That's a pretty rare ingredient. The only thing I can think that it was used for was... Actually, it's right here. Whoa. Look at all the refractory bricks be used. Oh my, what's going on with that? That's just silica. Isn't it? Hmm. Okay, well, we can make this a little bit better. I'm actually going to kill all of these. We kill all this and we're going to put in medium furnace ones. Okay. We're going to have these guys be refractory bricks. They're going to output to this bottom line here. Okay. We're going to feed in like this. And then you're going to feed out, except for you're going to put on the offset closest. And then we just need to give you some power. Cool. That should improve our brick production a fair bit, I would hope. Yeah, 15 seconds crafting time. Yeah. And then we could do some more. Since they're in high demand, let's go ahead and add a few more down here. Okay. I'll add one of these crucible stations as well. Cool. More sand being used. That's going to be good. Okay, that should help our furnace generation because we were building a lot of those. Holy moly. Now, refractory bricks. Hmm. Trying to decide the best place. Ah, uh, you know, this isn't a bad spot to do it. Okay. Extractor. Refractor bricks, relief valve, well, and steel sheets. So the steel sheets we can get easily. The refractory bricks going to be a little bit harder, but we can still manage. So let's see, shift L, duh, and duh, and plug in here. Now the relief valve, what does it take to make a relief valve? Remind me, game. Auxiliary valve and iron wire. So, where do we have aux valves? Anywhere close to here. We don't. So 
See, the ox valves are the green ones. Okay. We're going to do feed in, feed out. This chest, of course, is going to get replaced very soon. Then we need one here for the relief valves. Relief valves are actually something that we sometimes want to make, so... Hmm. Oh, we don't even need that pole. All right. Let's see, right here, we're going to go shift L, L. And then we're going to take this out of its hands. Shift L one more time. Nope. Okay, we're going to pick you up then and we're going to do this. And then we're going to put you here. Ooh, that's a long stretch. And then iron wire, we're going to put you here. Okay. We'll shove this guy in here. Relief valves, we're only going to do maybe two rows of this. Uh, belts, let's do more. We're going to start upgrading a lot of these machines too, which will help. Six is probably good. What your motors? Why are we not getting more motors? Iron plates? Really? Wow. Okay, I knew that this day was coming soon, but man. Okay. Okay. Let's see here. We're going to move this pole. Uh, right there. And we're going to move you here. We're going to take a couple along this side. Let's see. These two should do just fine. It's actually kind of exciting that this iron patch has all disappeared. Okay. And then we can do another one. Let's do a small here. Okay. Still, a lot of the stuff that is here is going to get taken out very, very soon. There still is at least supplemented by other stuff. Okay, I think this is as good as it's going to get. We probably have a little bit of iron, so let's go ahead and get it smashed. Nope. None. Surprising. All right, well, some improvements at least. Hmm. But iron plates are out. Eesh. That's pretty bad. Where are we going to tap our iron? It's not really worth it there. This one would be worth it. I don't think we're going to extend this stuff out too much further, so I think it's going to be here. 
So the iron factory is going to be out here in the snow. I think that's how this is going to work. Okay. It is what it is, then. Looks like almost all of our iron plate production is going into iron sheets, too. Oy. Um... I think it's the cutoff time for yellow signs. Sink or swim time, guys. We're gonna put in our shipment here. Yeah. No more. You guys are also gonna come here. We'll go on that side like that. That'll help for a little while. Now, let's see, the science station, we're gonna make a science train station here and it's gonna be similar to this guy. Except for it's gonna be down here. Yeah, we can just build it right here. I'll even build the sensor station as part of it, that's fine. Okay. Uh-oh. Let's take this one back, maybe. No, it's still not a connection. Hmm. Gotta take it a little bit. Don't know that this is gonna. Well, hang on. Rotate. There, that should work. Perfect. No? Really? Okay, that's good. So that's connected that way. We need some train stations. Let's put that on our request list. Because we're always needing those. Train stops. And while we're at it, let's request... Um, rail signals will be 100. And chain signals will be 50. So this is actually the opposite direction though. Okay, let's go down to radar coverage and we'll just fix this remotely. So it's left hand drive. Honestly, this whole thing would be much better if we just put it one space further down. We'll put two, three, right there. Let the robots go do some work. They must do something to fulfill themselves. Okay, we'll stand right here on the edge of logistics. Um, I'll put a roboport here. Okay. Okay, that looks good.
train should get here soon. Now you're gonna just go to there. And then you need to come this away. Yeah, that's fine. And then this one. We need to get a track that goes that way. Good. That covers all the directions. These poor robots having to lug all the stuff all the way out here. Now. Let's see. This is a normal. 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 Uh, let's do... That's normal. You're normal. It's not a track crossing, so that can be normal, normal, normal. Uh, you can be... Well, you're not going to get a chance to iron yourself out, so we're going to put you a little bit different than how I would like. Okay. That'll do. <clears throat> okay. Now, let's only unload one. I think these science trains are actually going to be even smaller than what we were doing. So we'll set off the second unloader. Okay, we can go a little bit more this way. And then you are going to be offset there. Okay. Control C. Darn. I'm actually just going to deconstruct all of this. We'll set this up right like so. Okay. So you're going to be material science unloader. Base material science drop off. Wait, what? Base material science drop off. There we go. So let's see. We'll get our train with this going. This is going to be base climate science drop off. And you're going to be base um, electronic science drop off. Okay. We're going to go ahead and take you along. Okay. Boy, those uh, dem accumulators, they're not too happy with us. It's fine. Now, not surprisingly, no yellow science. Yellow science is going to go here. Okay, we're going to deconstruct all of this and this stuff and this stuff. Probably find a few hiding patches too. Ooh, look at this. We found a hiding patch. Let's do a big one. 
and perfect. Now, we need to get our train going for this. Just one sec. Um, yeah, just a quick sec. We'll uh, just reboot. I gotta do this. Okay, good. All done. So that will help a little bit once we got our science going. Of course, you know, we're limited on science and oh, this is our precious one that we want to finish so badly. Um, let's go to our refueling station. That's probably the best most natural place to send a train off. I should have walked across there, but that's okay. I'm an idiot. Okay. I did pick up a few more locomotives, I think, at some point in time. So we just need one train car. Wait. Oh, fudge. Okay. You are going to go to base, material science, drop off, uh, empty cargo, and then fuel stop, inactivity. Yeah, we got potions. Oh boy, we got potions. This is exciting. Oh, so exciting to see this all work. I did want to load this up with fuel before we get it too far. So I wasn't sure how much it had. Cool. Anywho. What's next? What does that blinking symbol mean? That probably means a bot doesn't know where to drop its load off. Okay, we need a few more of those chests, the material ones. <gasps> Small demand chest! Okay, storage chest, storage chest. Uh, we need to make them, but we're going to need these guys here. I'm going to increase this to 400 because we're going to be using these, I think, a lot soon. And we're going to be able to transport them. Oh, this is so exciting. I cannot wait. I cannot wait to finally have everything free as a bird. Uh, it's somewhere down here. There's the yellow chest. We can see the line. Okay. Oh, I picked up large chests. Oh, whoops. Well, that's fine. Uh, we can just take these and we can build... We need sensors. Sensors are the things along with the antennas, so... Uh, we have both of them right here. If I want to kill my pathway, or we can do this. Yeah... Maybe. Do up to no, no good. Okay, 
shift L and then so this is the blue chests and then I need to get these sensors somehow um okay I don't like this we're gonna do something different Okay, I got what we're gonna do. So this will make the blue chests. So both of these are gonna be exactly the same. They're gonna be pick up a drop off there. And then we're going to... Load this in here. Um... just make a spot whoops yeah uh, we'll just do this okay and then we could put in a well we got a few of these storage chests uh, we have some red chests which we can put right here and you'll dump in there and we'll have them available oh fudge we moved those hmm okay Um, this is going to be silly. We're going to pick up there and we're going to drop off here. There we go. Ah, blue chests. <clears throat> okay, so we're going to have to put a lot of these down. So first and foremost, let's see. Got a lot of logistic spots. Let's go drop these guys off. Well, blue chests. Um, you know what? Let's start a fourth belt. And we're gonna make the robot parts to start with. Well, we'll start with these. Um, Build a demand chest. You're gonna demand uh, personal equipment, the small cargo pods. Okay. And you need to be put in here. Uh, red chests are something we should be demanding. Probably all of them actually. Red, yellow, and blue. <clears throat> okay. So this one is going to be another supply. You're going to be green or pink. 100 should be fine. Okay, you're going to be another blue. We're gonna need so many more bots too. Uh, let's just drop all of our bots out. So you need... I'm just gonna auto request all of these things. Yeah, if they're in the logistics network, we'll go ahead and take them. Now, we're going to increase this to a full stack. We're going to increase the open turbines a full stack. In fact, we'll do a full stack of all of the things. If they're in the inventory. Cool. <clears throat> and our bots are going, going.
Uh, where else do we have? We have a lot of these little chests that are dump chests around here. Because I knew someday we were going to get robots and it just wasn't worth it to fully invest ourselves until we had robots. Okay. Blue chest. You need... Small chest once. Hundred should be good. Um, we're gonna limit you to two stacks of those, I think. Relief valves. Iron wire. Oh, whoops! I forgot to put that in. So they're being made now. Good. These wells. Well, let's put the requester there, and then we can put um, yeah, we're going to put fifty wells, one stack of each. And then we're going to output you to here. Just one of these should do just fine. Okay, one stack of those. There's another one. Now, we don't have our blue chests yet, so let's see what we can do to get more blue chests, shall we? Oh, this is so nice to have these robots. This is just a lot of tediousness is going to go away. We're going to start massively upgrading stuff now. You need yellow chests. Okay. There we go. And let's see the yellow chests do need a supply chest so let's go ahead and take our new brand new guy we're gonna put you here we're going to supply you up uh, we need a demand chest there and then we need a roboport uh, we could put it here yeah why not there So this is the big one. The antennas, I'm actually going to cancel that one. We'll take you by the bus line because you do get the antennas by the bus. Okay, moving right along. Okay, we got 13 of these. I'm sure there's a checkpoint. No? Interesting that there's not one. Uh, rails is fine. There's something... Some other stuff around here that we had such needs. Um, I actually don't want this many big chests. I was doing it for the small chest twos. Okay. We've got our locomotives. Which are somewhere. I'm sure we'll be finding more of our little dump chests. Oh, here's 
Well, this is just um, to take surplus. We'll actually kill that chest now. That was back before we had Illumina manually or automatically delivered. Um, this guy. We need these guys delivered here. The miners, we have a big miner, miner problem. Um, you are here, okay, we're already getting you, perfect. Look at this. I could actually just dump this into my inventory and I trust that somebody will come and bring it somewhere useful. Okay. We're so, so little. Yeah, this is all just gonna die away. Um, what about a resource scanner? What would it take to build a resource scanner? It's probably a production building. It's one of it's not a sensor node. It's not a small beacon. Resource scanner. Small miner twos. So we're actually not doing those because we need the aluminum carbide. Mm. Okay. We'll get that figured out. Um, for right now, let's take these extractors. I just want to do the volcanic checkpoint real quick. Don't know what to expect at all with these, so we're just going to set up a couple of these. Where do these go? Hmm. I don't know where they go. From Fumarolis. What's a Fumaroli? Is that something we haven't found yet? I don't think we found those yet. I think that's probably the equivalent of oil. Oh. Yeah, I don't see anything, so we want a resource scanner for sure. Okay. Well, that's going to take some work because we need to get the aluminum carbide into the base. We should get a train going here. Okay. Um, last thing. For this episode, let's get the aluminum train going. And then we'll figure out the volcanic stuff. It's gonna be a little while, I think, before we're fully ready for it, but... Robots. Oh, this is so nice to have robot deliveries and just... Everything is gonna be so much easier to build. I'm still gonna try to bus. Uh, all of the elements. I don't want to get out of that habit, but when we have, you know, these weird recipes that require just a bunch of garbage, that's what we're going to try to do. So the iron, well, we do you have a, something that's taking the iron in, at least occasionally, because Science is getting produced, and that is consuming iron. Oh, we're actually loading this in as fast as we can. Hey. So we're just backlogged on our iron. Hmm. Maybe I should have one of those become a loader. Maybe we'll, we'll change around how we do this, but it's just making up for the backlog. But the big thing we need to do is we need to get our aluminum in, our aluminum products in. 
So the right order is sheets or plates, sheets, rods, wire. So let's do plates and sheets first. And I think, let's bring them all the way down. In fact, I'm gonna bring all four of them all the way down. taking up too much space. Let's go up like here. Okay. Whoops it is is There we go. Now, let's turn it here. Yeah, this is perfect. Then we got to get plates, sheets, <clears throat> think, um, we're actually Pulling this up a little bit faster. Yeah, graphite, no doubt, we're gonna run out of at some point in time. Fine. Hmm. Well, we ran out of belts. Okay. Next time we're going to get this wired up. Um, we may as well fix our miners here a little scooch. Oh, yeah, we don't have the belt for that either because they got confiscated right away. Uh, between episodes, I'm going to go stock up on belt. Hopefully, we'll have a lot more at the main base. Uh, let's take our sidewalk down by the train track. Might be a little bit dangerous. Hopefully, we're making good progress to our... Uh... Well, we should be making good progress to the next step, which is, what is our next step? I don't even know. We're making food progress at getting the aluminum in and we're gonna start doing an iron outpost soon because 
we need more iron. We need more blue science as well. I mean, we need a lot of stuff. Let's face it, guys. We just need all the things, but oof. Oof. Look at this. This is so sad. So sad that our iron is so, so over. Well, we're making progress, though. Stone processing is a little slow. Interesting. Okay. We're at least getting some plates again, so we should have some belts. Oh, look at all the belts we're getting. Cool. We do have a little bit of aluminum carbide, so we could start making some of the other stuff. Hmm. Well, I think this will do for now. Thanks, guys, for everything. Until next time, people on tracking. Take care. We will see you then. Bye-bye.